Commanders hosting the Ravens, and the Ravens are three-point favorites. The over-under is at 38.5 points. The Ravens are minus 160 on the money line, and Washington is plus 135. I believe this is the battle of the Beltway. Now, before you bet on this game, use a site like VegasInsider.com. This isn't a paid promotion. It's just free information that... It'll allow you to compare all of the casinos and all the sportsbooks pricings because generally they're all the same, but sometimes they're slightly different on the money line, the over under, even the point spread. Sometimes a, one sports book is a half a point different, and that half a point is the difference between winning and losing. Now, when I read off these stats, they're based off of how these teams have done head to head, and I know that the Ravens have some ridiculous preseason record going on, and it would only be all too ironic that they would lose it to the commanders. Head-to-head, -head, the road team's on a two-game winning streak. These teams are 2-2 two two against each other in their last four meetings. The home team is 2-2. Two two. The underdog is 2-2 two two against the spread. The favorite is 3-1 and one on the money line. The over-under is 2-2, two and, two, and the over-under at 38.5 is 2-2. Two two. Now, how much of Lamar Jackson are we going to see? How much of Odell are we going to see? How much Mark Andrews are we going to see? All very interesting questions because there is one fewer week in preseason now, so I imagine they're going to start to play these guys. A little bit more i imagine the third game will be the game that we see the most of them like a half maybe in this game we'll see a couple of drives out of the starters we shall see now in their last outing for both of these teams huntley was the leading uh passer 8 of 11 for 88 yards and a touchdown howell was the leading one for the commanders 9 of 12 for 77 and a touchdown hill was the leading rusher three carries for 48 yards rodriguez was the leading carrier for the commanders five for 39 and then Ryan was the leading receiver, four receptions, 37 yards. And then Pringle, one reception, 32 yards. The Ravens, like I said, won 20 to 19. They keep their preseason streak alive. And the Commanders beat the Browns. I was more so surprised by that one. I thought the Browns would have came out and had a better showing, but they didn't. Now, just because the Ravens just have this ridiculous streak in the preseason, I'm going to roll with them until they lose it. Ravens with the money line, Ravens laying the three points, and I'm going to go over because even if you took the Commanders getting three, all you can do is push. Same thing with the Ravens if they win this game by a field goal. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.